Hi everyone. I hope you enjoyed the last video and made the toy too. Today we will talk about an astronaut. The story of Yuri Gagarin. Let's start. Yuri Gagarin, first man in space. Yuri Gagarin was born near Moscow in Russia on 9th March 1934. He was the son of a carpenter. Yuri joined the Air Force in 1955 and by 1959 he was training to become a cosmonaut. You know what is a cosmonaut? A Russian astronaut is called a cosmonaut. You know who an Indian astronaut is called? He is called a vyomonaut. Vyoma means space or sky in Sanskrit. In 1960, Yuri was selected along with 19 other candidates for the Vostok 1 program. Eventually, the program was not narrowed down to two possible candidates. Yuri and German Tikto both had excellent performance in their training and were short enough to fit in the Vostok cockpit. Yuri was perhaps selected because of his modest behavior and the other candidates voted for his excellent memory skills, fast reactions and mathematical skills. At the age of 27, on the morning of 12th of April 1961, cosmonaut Yuri was helped into his spacesuit and made his way to the launch pad. He climbed the Vostok spacecraft and wondered if I would return back to Earth. But Yuri was calm. At 9 a.m., as the engines rumbled, Yuri said, Let's go! The rockets blazed into the space. In 10 minutes, Vostok spacecraft separated from the launch pad. Yuri was in space now. He crossed the Atlantic Ocean, then the Pacific Ocean. As his spacecraft passed over Africa, he prepared to re-enter the Earth's atmosphere, which was not easy. He had to orbit the Earth for 108 minutes during this flight. He had made his re-entry, but... The cables joining the Vostok descent module to the service module failed to detach properly. This caused a disaster as it violently shook Yuri until they eventually pulled apart. As he re-entered the Earth's atmosphere, he experienced forces up to eight times the Earth's gravity because the Vostok spacecraft had no engine to slow down its re-entry. Yuri had to eject out and parachute to the earth. He landed safely near the Volgo River. Yuri was a national hero now. He became a global celebrity. And all of us know him as the first man in space. I hope you all loved the story and now we are going to make a rocket. Bye! Friends, I hope you have enjoyed playing with the last toy that we made. Today we are going to make a rocket. It is a very easy toy. You can make it at home, inside the home, in your courtyard, anywhere. We only need a thread, a balloon, a piece of straw, you can use an empty refill also and some sellotape. Let's start. Now slide the thread inside a straw piece or an empty refill, whatever you have and tie the thread to the two ends as I've done it here. Inflate the balloon and stick it to the straw below with a sellotape. I'll show you how. Ready? Yeah. As you could see in the balloon.
balloon, the air was coming out from this side and the balloon moved in the front side. Now here, if we say that the air coming out is the action and the balloon going in the front is the reaction, we can simply say that every action has an equal, opposite and instantaneous reaction. This is nothing but Newton's third law of motion. Hey, do you remember Newton? Yes, he is the scientist we discussed in the last video. Hope you enjoyed the video and enjoyed the toy. Let's meet up next time. Bye.